Hello, my name is Kaede Farm. This is Farm Fit, where your health is your wealth. Today, we will be exploring exercise and the relief of back pain. And I'm delighted to be joined by the amazing Tonya. Hey, Kaede, how are you? I'm fine. I'm excited that you're here. I'm glad to be here. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Tonya, look, as a singer, recording artist, mm -hmm. you know, busy schedule, and as a woman, Okay. What has been your experience with back pain that you'd like to share with the viewers? Well, first of all, you know, because I am a woman, we wear heels all the time, so that already causes you to have a bad back. Second of all, I take a body pump class, which requires me to carry heavy weights. And what I've noticed is every time I do my squats, I have really bad lower right. back pain. Yeah, so, I'm sure. Yeah, so this is definitely something that I need. Okay, and it's not just for women. It's for everybody. Everybody keeps calling me and saying, look, I'm getting, you know, pains in my back. And especially as we get older, you know, it seems to be becoming more and more, you know, common. Uh, what can we do? You know, how do we deal with this? Uh, the, the issue is exercise, okay, and stretching. We're not stretching enough. We're not exercising enough. And this exacerbates um, lower back pain. Sometimes the reasons can be as simple as bad posture. Okay, you said like, wearing like, heels. Like me. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like me. Other times, the reason could be because you're picking up heavy weights and it's like, oh, you pull something in your back, maybe you slip a disc or something. And sometimes it can be because you're in the gym and you're just not doing exercising correctly. You know, your form is poor. But whatever the cause, we have got to exercise and stretch more regularly. And I'm going to go through some exercises that really help in relieving back pain. Okay, so let's do this right now. Viewers, please remember always have a bottle of water handy, okay, before any exercise program. And if you feel faint or dizzy or get any pain in your back, you know, any major discomfort in your back while you're doing these exercises, please stop and consult your medical advisors. Safety first. Safety first. Always. Okay. Now I'm going to walk you through some exercises that can really help to alleviate and relieve back pain. Okay, the first thing, all right, team, with me is just rotate those hips. Gently rotate them clockwise, counterclockwise to start off with. There we go. You know, gentle, you can widen that rotation. You know, feel it sometimes in the lower back. Okay, now let's go clockwise the other way. That's it. So just gently rotate. There we go. Nice and easy. Okay, and you'll feel that a little bit in the lower back. So for those who have pain, this should be the first point of call. And then, as we demonstrated uh, in the uh, yoga and stretching um, video, let's go back and ease nice and in. This one now relax because it's the lower back. We don't want to stress it, and let's come back up. Okay, let's do that one more time. That's it. This is a light back bend, not too much. Again, those with lower back pain, if you're feeling any discomfort, just go to the, the biting point and back up. Again, just to start to prepare it, um, you know, to sort of say, okay, now we're gonna really get to work. Now we've got to go onto the mat. This stretch is called the, the cat stretch. I particularly like it, it's particularly effective. Uh, a lot of yogis, yoga practitioners uh, do this stretch and it really, really works. So for those of you who really have some problems, even if you don't do the rotation or the back arc, you've gotta do this stretch. Okay, let's go to the, the floor. Yeah, lie down, lie down, there we go, lie down, lie down. Okay guys, okay team. And then what we do is we just push ourselves up, up, so we lock our arms. You should feel it in that lower back, look up, look up, look up. Thank you, look up. How are we doing? Gotta look up a little bit, yeah, give me a little bit, uh-huh. Come back down, we're gonna do this a couple of times, so don't worry team. Maybe you want to bring the arm, the hands back a little bit. Yeah, just a little bit. Just, yeah, uh, that's it. Just bring the back up a little bit. Don't be too far out because you're not going to be able to arch up enough. Just bring it back a little bit. You'll feel a little bit of pressure on the triceps, but don't worry. It's a good workout for the triceps. See if yours slowly go up. Okay, sometimes also called the cobra stretch. You know, it's what, it's what cats and cobras do. Exercise, very, very useful. Um, yoga, a lot of uh, yoga practitioners use it. Um, we're going to extend the left leg at the same time, extend the right leg back. Okay? And then we're going to do the same thing, okay, the other side. So let's do it together. All right, team? Two, three, let's go. That's right. Hold it. Here we go. Well done. 
and the other side. Alternate arm and leg. Get that leg out, right out. You should feel it on the butt, but you also feel it on the low back. Great exercise for the low back viewers. Anyone who has low back pain, please be doing this exercise regularly. Again. Beautiful. That's it, reach, reach. And the last one. Arms to the side, palms on the ground, everybody. Okay, team? Okay. All right, and then now, we just gently arch up. There we go. As much as we can. Gently arch up, keep the arms, keep the palms flat on the ground. You know, keep the soles of the feet flat on the ground. Arch up and back down, gently. Okay, let's try it again. Arch up. And back down. Uh -huh. Put your arms around it, bring your feet to the chest as much as you can. Sometimes it's a little bit awkward. Hold it, and then rock, just a little bit. Rock side to side. Again, this is really good for the lower back. Rock side to side, there we go. A little bit more, just rock a little bit side to side. This is all lower back. Put your feet gently back down on the ground. Nice and easy. Well done, team. And now, let's bring our leg over, one over the other to the front. Okay, so we can feel the hip. Okay, make this, let it relax, let it hang. Okay, look the other direction. By the legs to the front, look to the back. Hold it for a while, let's let it hang. You should feel it in those hips, but you should also feel it in that lower back as well. Okay, good, same again to the back. Bring it back, let's bring one leg over the other. All right, in the butterfly stretch, all we're doing here, put your two feet together like this on the, on the, on the ground. Don't worry, I'm not gonna ask every, anybody to open up here. That's another, a different kind of stretch. But what I want people to do is just to, you know, use your elbows, grab, and come as forward as you can, but just lean forward and feel it a little bit. Just add a little bit of pressure on that lower back. That's it, when you come forward, you should just feel a little bit of pressure on the lower back. Don't overdo it. Now, I'm not asking you, you know, to do anything, you know, advanced, like bring your head all the way down or anything like that. In this position, it's all about that lower back and it's all about just stretching it. So gently, you know, coming forward and just getting, you know, some tension out of the back and just, you know, allowing that lower back to stretch. Almost like you're trying to get the kinks. That's it. Just almost like you're trying to get the kinks out of that lower back. You'll feel it. Just let it, just let it come out, touch it, hold it for a bit, you know, relax again. Maybe one more time, one more time team. Good job, good job team. Just one more time, that's it. Just feeling that lower back. You know, sometimes by just looking upright, it helps so that you really focus on that lower back. I hope you've all enjoyed this segment on exercise and the relief of back pain as much as we've all enjoyed presenting it to you. Haven't we team? Sure. Amazing. Well done team, good job. Okay, now, Tony, you mentioned at the beginning, we talked about back pain, we talked about women, high heels. Let us now you know, give us some comments about this experience. Well, I have to tell you, this experience was actually quite refreshing. I, especially that butterfly stretch. I feel like it stretched me all the way, um, you know, my inner thighs and my lower back. And like I said, I do a lot of squats with weighted squats, actually, and it always, always affects my lower oh, back. Of course, yeah. And I just needed something. To Everybody who does needed. squats always gets that lower back yeah. issue. Yeah, so, so. you know, like I said, you can't be running out the gym. You have to sit down and actually do that stretch. And I think it would really help. Yeah, and if you do it regularly, like every day, I, I, I'm telling you right now, guaranteed, okay. a lot of that discomfort will just ease okay. the time. Okay, make sure you check out some other great farm fit uh, videos. Um, and remember, just do these exercises uh, for, low, for the lower back that we've demonstrated. Do them regularly, every day, every other day, and fix that back pain, okay? This is Farm Fit, your health is your wealth. Let's do it, let's go for it. Bye for now.